And dentists are using new technology. Oh yeah, they're still using the drill, but they're using this new technology. They say it's a, a lot like weather forecasting. They say they're finding storms of sorts in people's mouths. Brianna Berman Solo explains it may be changing just how fast cavities are found at your next trip to the dentist. When weather forecasters show the Doppler radar to talk about weather, we're using different color indicators. Green usually means rain, yellow or red can mean heavy rain or thunderstorms, and pink means snow. Now here's the radar imagery one local dentist is using to look at teeth. And does it look familiar? Only on this map, green shows a healthy tooth structure, blue and red indicate early stages of tooth decay, and yellow shows more serious problems. Okay. It's predicting, you know, where the storms are at on the tooth. It'll tell me there's a really bad area, you know, on this particular location. When Dr. Todd Weller heard about a new cavity detection technology a couple of years ago, he jumped at the chance to get his hands on this tiny camera. It tells me exactly where the cavity is. It tells me how deep it is. To this day in two years, it hasn't failed me yet. Um, it's been, you know, exactly right every time. Weller owns a practice in North Spokane where he uses the Doppler-like technology on more than half of his patients. The bacteria that causes the cavities is fluorescing. So the more bacteria in there, the deeper the cavity, the more it fluoresces. And so it tells me, you know, exactly the depth, which can then lead me to crowns and root canals. He said the Spectra UV camera eliminates the guesswork. And good news for those of us who get uneasy at the dentist, increased accuracy sometimes means less time spent under the drill. It's bad here. It's not real bad over here. Yes, I'd probably fix that area. At the it works best on patients who don't already have a lot of dental work. Of course, I couldn't visit Dr. Weller's office without trying out the Spectra camera myself. He spent about a minute or less inside my mouth with the tiny camera and was able to show me exactly how my teeth shape up. Lo and behold, he found a cavity. Because I love to have my patients believe what I'm telling them. Mm -hmm. And when I can put that picture up and show them exactly where the cavity is located, how deep it is, and then I can compare it to an intraoral photograph that I've taken of the tooth, you can't really argue with it. The evidence is in the Doppler. So it looks like I'll be going back to the dentist to get that cavity fixed. I'm Brianna Solo for Creme 2 News. My heat.